Why, hello there. Wouldn't you know it? It's Tuesday. And of course, Tuesday nowadays means Fallout, so Fallout is what we're doing. Hello, Arthur. Yes. Praise the sun! No, we're not praising the sun today. No, 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 no sorry, Bob. We are role-playing in Fallout 3. Why? I don't know. <laughs> At some point in my life, I decided that was a good idea, so that's what I'm doing. So, if y'all would like to join me, please, hang around, stick around, and um, do all manner of things that are round. Or don't. I'm not your dad. So, with that uh, failure of an introduction out of the way, let's, uh, let's get going. But, you know, right before a bit more ado, the time to explain uh, what's happening here. Well, um, last time we left off, we were outside Rivet City, and, well, Vera there had agreed to take... How may I serve you? That's rude. I'm talking to people. Admittedly, they're imaginary people in my head, but talking to people. That's all. Yes, sir. Okay. Hey. So, yes, Vera there... Sir. Uh, agreed to take in Brian Wilkes, who we'd left in Greenwich after his dad died from the fire ants. So, in between streams, I decided to, you know, let's, uh, let's cut the chore a little bit, go and get him from Greenwich, and then escort him to, you don't actually have to escort him, he makes his way, um, here anyway. But I couldn't live with myself just letting him do that. So, yeah, I escorted him back, managed to kill some raiders, find some uh, more ammo, and I sold a bunch of stuff, and I bought more ammo, so... That's where- oh, I leveled up too. So, we are currently... At level... D -d 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 four. Okay? Okay, that's what happened in between. Now, on with the show. <laughs> right. <coughs> So how are you doing? Checking up on me or something? Something. Uh, how are you getting along with, uh, what was it? Cousin Vera? Aunt Vera? She calls you her nephew, so I, I, I don't know. Oh, Vera's the nicest lady ever. It's so cool that you brought me here. I mean, she makes me do stuff, like clean up her hotel and all that, but she really cares about me. Plus, I found some friends here in Rivet City, too. All thanks to you. Well, sounds like she's, uh, getting you to help her. So, yeah. It's better than living out in Greenwich all by yourself. See ya, mister. Yep. You have a good one, Brian. Welcome to the Weatherly Hotel. Thank you. And, uh, you take care of him. Vera, I heard there's a science lab on this boat. I'ma check the science lab. Well, it's not so much that I heard about it. Oh yeah, I finally mapped the <laughs> the um, status effects uh, key to, well, something. And I can check whether or not I'm hungry, thirsty, or sleepy because, well, I've had this Pip-Boy on my arm since I was 10 and um, I can't function as a regular human being anymore. <laughs> Oh well. I'd like to go. I think the science yes. lab is that way. Like I'm saying, the science lab is that way. Scoot. Tamper with that, and we're going to have a problem. I'm about to temper with your head if you don't move. All right. Okay. Hello, salty. All right. Science lab. There it is. Rivet City Clinic. Doctor Lee. Doctor Lee. Uh, some reason that name sounds familiar. Oh, something's happening. Look, Dr. Zimmer, we've been over this. We don't know about your runaway robot, and we don't care. This lab is dedicated to solving real problems. Yes, yes, yes. But Dr. Lee, 
Dr. Lee That's is trying to again. save lives, and your constant interruptions are interfering with those efforts. Now please, stand aside. I'm sure the good doctor's work with water purification is fascinating, but if you only knew what was at stake, the technology in that android... What's at stake? You won't tell me what's at mm, stake. Stay. Vagaries and secrecy. A robot's a robot, Zimmer, no matter how shiny the paint job. Now, please. Ignorance and facetiousness. That's all you people are good for. Shiny paint job, indeed. You can't even imagine the Commonwealth's accomplishments. You know, if you're so smart, maybe you could help us, hmm? But no, that never even crossed your mind. Go peddle your selfishness somewhere else. Fine, but I'm not leaving. Not until I've spoken to Dr. Lee. I'll be here when she's ready to abandon her chemistry set and talk real science. Suit yourself. Ooh. <laughs> Them some insults being leveraged uh, over there. You there. What are you, some kind of lab assistant? No, you look a bit more weathered. Are you what, by any what do you mean by that? For hire? Um, that depends. What are we talking about? To the point. I like that. Well, as it turns out, I've misplaced some very sensitive property. What kind of property? Hmm. How do I put this in a way you'll understand? Uh, All you know of robots fuck you? are those buckets of bolts. <laughs> How's that for understanding? Mr. Handshakers and whatnot. <laughs> Well, that's not all a robot can be. You see, in the Commonwealth, we've made artificial persons, synthetic humanoids, programmed to think and feel and do whatever we need. And occasionally, <laughs> they get confused and wander off. <laughs> uh, okay, and uh, what's that got to do with me? You're helping me retrieve this android. Aren't you? Am I? I tracked him this far. <laughs> He's out there somewhere. In the capital wasteland. He must have done something drastic. Like facial surgery and a mind wipe. Or else I would have found him by now. It will be no easy You're task. a bell end, Arthur. He may not even realize he's an android. Don't upset him by talking with him. Just come get me immediately. I'll handle it. Right. Okay. And what's in it for me exactly? Of course. I have at my disposal advanced technology from the Commonwealth. I'd be willing to share some of it with you. Just think, you'll be the envy of all your friends. How old do you think I am? All right, fine. I'll, if I find the android, I'll Excellent. bring it back. Locate my android, and you won't be disappointed. Here, listen to this message he sent me. He's mocking me. I swear, I'll make him pay for that. Okay, thank you for the holotape, but I gotta go now. Of course you do. What's that Janice, supposed to mean? Janice, have you overbalanced the chemical mix? They should be just fine. Try it again. Oh, hello. Some people are in such a hurry. I'm, uh... If you'll excuse me, I'm gonna take that. What do you want? I... Hello? Look, this is a restricted area. I'm tired of telling you people. I... It's you. Excuse you? My heavens, you look so much like him. Eh? You're James's son, aren't you? What are you doing here? Okay. Eh? <laughs> so, according to Moriarty, I wasn't born in a vault, so I'm assuming you know, uh, my dad. Right? Uh, you, you know Liam Neeson? You were too young to remember, and I suppose James never spoke of me. Typical. I am Dr. Madison Lee. I worked with your parents many years ago. Now I run the science lab here in Rivet City. It was all I had left. When your mother died, your father decided to leave with you. He abandoned our work. We had no choice but to do the same. Right. Okay. Uh, actually, I, I am... I suppose I'm still looking for my father. It's It's been a while. <laughs> I got a little distracted on the way, but uh, have you seen him? You mean you haven't? I assumed he sent you here. For that matter, aren't you supposed to be in a vault? James said he left you there. Yeah, this isn't about me. Um, where is he? Your father is no longer here, and I'd appreciate it if you didn't use that tone with me. 
you'd appreciate it if you could go fuck yourself. Uh, stop wasting my time and tell me where he well, is. Well, I don't know where he is. The last I knew, he was going back to the old lab. Now, will you kindly leave? I have work to do. Um, and where is the old lab? It's in the old Jefferson Memorial Building, northwest of here. Please, Actually, don't I know where go that after is. him. It was <laughs> foolish of him to even think about going there alone. Okay. Um, so... Peace. Good luck finding your father. <laughs> yeah, I can't imagine why Dad didn't mention her. Um... Alright, so... Jefferson Memorial. Okay. Alright. I've been there. I... Actually, I... Uh, that was the that place that had the gift shop sign outside. I very much... Uh, well, I was gonna go there anyway, but... Well, well. In that case... Uh, you know, if you're going to put a sign saying do not enter in front of a door, I'm just gonna let my... Never mind. It's locked. Um... <laughs> I was gonna just let myself in, but... How's that? Common room. Working terminal in the common room? That's fancy. Hey. You look stoned as balls, dude. I mean, judging by what you're doing to that doorway, yep, you are. <laughs> Clicked on the wrong tone. <laughs> hey. Uh, marketplace. Eh, eh. FX boy forever. Thanks for the follow. How come you weren't following us? <laughs> that is a shotgun on my back. That's the combat shotgun that I got last time. Um, right. <laughs> I think this leads out. It does? Oh. Well, I suppose with a trip to Great Itch and then coming back that, yeah, no. Maybe nighttime was to be expected. Oh well. If I can't see the super mutants, they can't see me. <laughs> yeah, they have a drum magazine. Uh, supposedly, that was the uh, extended drum magazine version, and well, Bethesda decided uh, in Fallout 4 to expand on it even more, because when you go all the way down to Boston, uh, you can make one of these be automatic. <laughs> But they're not as overpowered as they are in the uh, capital wasteland here. <laughs> okay. Oh, I guess uh, Lucky Harith's already left. It eh, makes sense. <laughs> Basically, yeah. <laughs> okay, so. Uh, just so I'm not going crazy because I can't really see much at night, Jefferson Memorial is dead ahead. Cool. So we're gonna do that then. Yeah, speaking of the caravan, there they go. That's a little too close for comfort with the super mutants. Part of me wants to just sit here and watch. Uh... The other part of me really doesn't. Well, if they can get past them, so can I. Are you? <laughs> I did dip my toes a little bit. How are the super mutants not taking pot shots at them? Okay, I guess the super mutants are gone. Maybe they went on a raid? That is freaking weird. Yeah, there's no one up there. Well, there's someone up there. 
Howdy. Hello. Yes. Um. Okay. If going to be sandal words, hey. <laughs> oh, there will if, if there are going to be loud sounds. Uh. Well, the probably there will be. There's a lot of shooting happening. <laughs> But the combat shotgun is not the loudest. <laughs> if I ever find an Ithaca shotgun, then, then uh, you you should worry. <laughs> well, there is in fact a captive person here. Let's untie her. What? Who? You mean? Are you for real? I'm safe. Wow, your mastery I'm, of the I need English to get language out of here. is worse than mine. Here, take these supplies. It's all I have, but they'll only slow me down. I'll take that then. That they won't catch they'll me They'll slow again. you down. Thanks. Um, what the heck did you just knock over? Ooh, an assault rifle. Well, I already have one, but maybe there's ammo in it. Who knows? Uh, some ammo boxes and a lot of gross stuff that I'm not entirely sure I want to put my hand in again. Um, okay, that's uh, stick a mulligan on that. There it is. Ooh, more missiles. I'll take the missiles. Uh, I saw things, yes. Oh, more things. <laughs> yes. <laughs> See, there's a blood pack, and another blood pack, and an aspirin. Sure, I'll take the aspirin, that's that's fine. What's this? Lying, congressional style. What's a congress? Uh, more locks. Mm-hmm. There it is, okay. Ooh, that's a lot of ammo. I'll take a lot of ammo. A lot of ammo is good, means you can sell it. <laughs> Okay, since there's no one here, I'm gonna run. I've already freed the captive, so she's good to go. And I'm gonna... Well, I'm gonna go the same way that caravan went. Because they're kinda heading my way, so... I'ma follow them. <laughs> uh, th there is when you're carrying so many weapons that you can't, you know run anymore. Hey, there's the caravan again. Alright, and uh... Is that the captive? I think I saw something run behind that rock there. Could be the captive. Not sure. Okay. Well, in that case, hello there, Jefferson Memorial. Let's, uh... Let's have a look, say. Oh, hello. Can I... I missed! <laughs> okay. Two out of three? I'll take it! <laughs> that sounded lasery. And that's how to explode. Actually, speaking of laser, I have a bunch of ammo for the yes, for the Watts laser pistol, and I have yet to use it. I suppose I should give it a shot. Eh, push comes to shove. Do I hear something? I can't really hear anything. Oh, well, there's a dead super mutant there. And the gift shop is that way, because of course it is. Alright, what did you have? Oh, you had another M1 Garand. Alright, I'll take it. That was a footstep, kicking something. That 
looks like a combat shotgun on that um, super mutant's back. So let's not get close. Take a pot shot from here if we can. Sledgehammer is not going to help us do that. Ooh. See, that might be loud. I don't want to get terribly close, but I don't think I have much of a choice in the matter. Where is he? There he is. Now try and hide pew pew! Death. Okay, this pew pew gun now is not cutting it. Ah, <laughs> uh, let's see. You. <laughs> Wow, they said that in stereo. That 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 pistol did not deal. <laughs> Aha! <laughs> okay. This is why I keep running out of ammo for this thing. Oh, crap, there's another one. <laughs> it's so useful. <laughs> oh, come on, what are you doing? Stop running into the wall. I heard that they're not the brightest, but that's just stupid. <laughs> Hello, Linchen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, all right. So uh, I'm once again damn near out of ammo for this thing. Cool. But hey, close quarters. Shotgun, right? Right? And uh, you had a frag grenade. Gimme. And you. See? Told you you had a shotgun. <laughs> ah, damn near full auto shotgun at that. Um... Okay, time to uh, go and check out that gift shop because, uh, yes. Ooh, more shotgun. And let's see. How do we even spell that? Or pronounce it, I should say. Alprazolam? Alprazolam. Sounds right. I don't know. Probably off by <laughs> a long shot, but no. Yeah. Alright, uh, there's some ammo, there's a suitcase with only an ashtray. What's the deal with people carrying, uh, you know, like old worldy people carrying ashtrays in their suitcases? I mean, you'd think that's the last thing you'd want to come into contact with your clothes, but no, I don't know. Uh, let's see, 919, yes, 9 mils are always welcome, 10 mils are very welcome, ooh! 556 my um assault rifle will appreciate that oh so very much <laughs> marzipan <laughs> okay well that gift shop was uh, slightly well okay all right to be fair it had some 10 mil ammo and it had some 9 mil ammo and it had some 556 mil ammo so no, that, that, that's, that's pretty good. Basement. Of course there's a basement. Actually, let's check the basement first. <laughs> Is that just a straight up sewer grate? That's got a key lock on it. All right. All right, that lock. I'm not... Mm. Hmm. There's some Nuka Cola in there because, of course, there is. Why wouldn't there be? <laughs> There's always Nuka Cola. I'll take one. <laughs> well, smoking used to be a thing everywhere. The uh, sneak out a couple of nights with the Mata and um, some of the other peeps from class. Because uh, someone was clearly smuggling cigarettes into the vault, but let's not get bogged down into the details. 
All right. Well, that sounds like, um, that sounds like Super Mutant. Yeah? Wish I had a new weapon. Something good to smash with. Wish I could hold one of those behemoth one. clubs. So big. So much crush. Um, so much crush. Well, uh, I need to quote sure. that out of context. Uh, I need to quote that out of context uh, so much. <laughs> Talk with you is stupid. No, I already lost on that one. Um, okay. Ooh, 44 Magnum. Not not touching that. <laughs> snack. No, step on snack. No. There's a lot of footsteps around me. Very big, heavy footsteps. Okay, well, this is gonna be loud anyway, so whatevs. God, that hit me right in the arm. <laughs> oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> no step on snack. No step on snack. Let's see. I do have a silenced pistol. I doubt it'll do much, but we're gonna try. I'll wear your bones around nope. my neck! This doesn't work. <laughs> you. Oh. We are oh. Okay. Oh! God! Oh. <laughs> Okay, maybe if we change into something before we <laughs> go tango with them. <laughs> Ow, that hit me right in the back of the head. Oh. <laughs> um, not if I can get to it first. Oh. <laughs> 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 Alright, um, I do hear a lot of them around me, so... <laughs> I do have some grenades, but I can never trust them. Uh, what I needed was more ammo for this, because, yeah, no, ooh. Actually, that might be an idea. Howdy. I don't know where that's going to land, but I hope it's not on me. <laughs> ah, jammed! <laughs> Turn the corner! Alright, 
that, 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 that. Uh, full auto shotgun and whatnot might work. I just need to be better at it. Try and hide from Why was I not running? <laughs> okay. Game's over. Come on. He too has a full auto weapon. It's running away. <laughs> Not that way. <laughs> it's reloading. Now's about chance. <laughs> That dealt no damage. <laughs> oh, I don't trust vats. I don't trust vats at all. <laughs> one more. I hear one more. Sup? That took some doing. Okay. All right. <laughs> so, uh, that uh, automatic thing that the the one with the helmet, where is it? There he is. What were you shooting at me with? A brawning automatic rifle. That, that, okay. The pep boy does say that does deal a lot of damage. So I'm going to take that from you. Thank you. <laughs> And you give me grenades. Probably still not going to use them, but uh, what else? Ooh, there's some Project Purity journal entries here. I shall take them. You know, now that things are a bit quieter, this looks familiar. Uh. This looks awfully familiar. Huh. All right. Okay, so um, I think this, uh, what did a bit boy call it? Neostead combat shotgun is uh, worth keeping around. And um, well, we do have some ammo, so Let's try this bar. According to the Pip Boy, my strength makes it easier to use this weapon. So, probably safe to assume it's got a bit of a kick to it. Cool. Actually, uh, these are two things that I need to make a toolkit. I don't remember exactly what the um what the full requirements are to have something that you could call a toolkit, but I do need something that'll help you repair weapons better. Well Well if Dad used to be here they took all the valuables. That's empty. That's empty. That's empty. And that's certainly not Mike Tehan. Oh no, wait, it is empty. <laughs> All right. Ooh. There's some pre war money and the clipboard, so. All right, we'll take the pre war money. Flood control. Oh, where your bones are 
<laughs> I need to be a little bit quicker on the trigger, but yeah, that saved my life. Also, ow. He hit me with the hilt of that thing right across the face. We're, um, yeah, using one of them. Okay, so I think I need to find me some, um, what I must does this day? The 3006. Okay. I'll find me some of that then. Anyone here? Okay. Just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. Well, I guess Dad wouldn't be here on accounts of, you know, super mutants. Though he did live a pistol behind, so I'll take that. Suitcase with some money. Alright. What else? That's where I went. What's over here? There's things here. Right away. 556. Always welcome. Some 32. You can keep the uh, 32 revolver. I don't really have a use for one of them. I need something with a lot. A lot of bullets in the magazine. I can't do with just a few. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of holotapes. Oh, ew! I just realized what happened to that man. That's where mom and dad got. Okay, no, not not. I'm just gonna take these and that. No, mm -mm. not gonna happen. <laughs> Revelation twenty one six. That's where I was conceived. There. <laughs> <laughs> End of verse. That that's good enough for me. Um. Okay, that's you. <laughs> All right. Uh. So. It's not. Doesn't have any power. Okay. Uh. All right. No power. Okay, suppose I should go look for something else. <laughs> well, there's those two doors that the signs claim they go to the rotunda. Which, um, let's call it a sneaking suspicion. Yep, there's super mutants here. Ooh, fancy. Who well, hasn't seen me yet, but I'm gonna have to make him see me. There's no one else back there. There's another one up there. Okay. No, you're not picking that up again. I'm sorry, but that's just not happening. Speaking of, that looked familiar. Gimme. Eh, yeah, FN fall. Not enough ammo, and I'm running out of ammo for this one, so... Let's hope the 10 mil is enough. At least it's got a good rate of fire. Yes, that grenade you were going to throw at me. And the one you have in your hand. He was gonna double fist me with grenades? That, that's just crazy sauce. There's something here. No. No. Okay. Seems like a good place to hide something, but there's nothing there. Uh, that also looks like a good place to hide something. Get out of the way. 
Oh, I see. The laws of physics are telling me to go fuck myself. Gotcha. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, we've had plenty of examples of the laws of physics telling me to go fuck myself. Um... And queens teleporting behind me, uh, Dragon Ball Z style. Uh, what else? <laughs> the things shooting up at the skies. It's yet yeah, no. Uh, five, eight, and ten. I hope that's not alive. Ooh, I can play with the numbers. Let's play with the numbers. Oh. You know, for something that's out of power, that's, uh... That's terribly lit up. Uh, property 01 system control. Okay. Nothing up there. Also? That looks pretty cool. I gotta admit, that does look pretty cool. Probably terribly radioactive and I have three kinds of cancer just from looking at it wrong, but... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, the reels are turning? Oh, yeah. Well, they are turning, but there's no tape. <laughs> they're just... Yeah, they're just... Going back and forth, back and forth. Yeah, well, I don't have a reel to replace it, so... Whatever was stored in that particular bit of tape is very much gone. And I think I've been everywhere. And, well, no, I haven't been on this side. Nothing there. Filing cabinets. Ooh. No money. Uh, 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 that's disappointing. Anything here? 432 um, bullets. Okay. That, that, that's fine. Yeah. Now I've been everywhere, so I guess it's time... Time, Dr. Freeman. To listen to... Project Purity Personal Journal. Right. I'm off to Vault 1 oh, hello. to search for anything at Braun's that might help me get this purifier up and running. All I know is that it's west of some place called Evergreen Mills, and it's well hidden in some sort of garage. But I'll find it. I have to. It's so close. But that's the story of Project Purity, isn't it? An eternity of almost theirs. Let's see if Braun has the missing puzzle piece. Okay, uh, so well hidden west of, was it, did he say west or east? I'm off to Vault 112 to search. Oh, god damn it, this Pip-Boy, what is this, a model, a yes, it is a model A. I, know is that I can't west of some place scroll. Evergreen Mills. West. And it's well hidden west. In some sort of garage, but I'll find it. A garage west of Evergreen Mills. It's Where the hell is Evergreen Mills? That's the story of Project Pure. Uh, it, to be honest, the Gex sounded like pure fantasy, even for someone of Braun's capabilities. It was nothing short of a miracle. A terraforming module capable of producing life from complete lifelessness. Gek. Not only was this thing a reality... Oh, the Garden of Eden creation kit. I saw that in the Overseer's Terminal. Of an atomic war. Vault 101 was, sadly, not on that list. And so did, did that, apparently. I discovered Braun's name on the reservation list for a Vault 112. I'm no slouch, but this man, he could have easily succeeded where I failed. Does his collected knowledge remain within the halls of Vault 112? Journals, hollow tapes, computer records, maybe even experiments. If I could gain access to just a fraction of Braun's genius, Project Purity would become a reality. Okay. So he's gone to find the creator of the Garden of Eden creation kit. Right. And here I thought I was delusional. Okay. Um. 
West of Evergreen Mills. Hey, Pip Boy, do you know where Evergreen Mills is? Well, you know where Girder Shade is, so. There's that. I'm going to pretend I did not see that. Um. West. Well, I can start heading west. If I find Evergreen Mills, then. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Westwards, then. But I'm not swimming across. That's for damn sure. <laughs> It's also getting really dark. Um, no, 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 I, I'm okay not having radiation poisoning. Is that... Of course there's a mire lurk. A stupid two-legged crabs. Okay, so we gotta cross the river again. <sighs> God damn it. Oh well, this is going to be a bit of a long road. Evergreen Mill, west of Evergreen Mills. I'll look for Evergreen Mills then. Wait a second. Okay, so if that's the map grid, that's a bridge, right? And that's gotta be a bridge, right? <laughs> um, that w it would be really nice if that was a bridge because I really don't want to. Uh oh, god damn it! Another one of you. Okay. Mm, surprise. I came through here and I did not see that one. It was the other one. Did it eat its corpse along with the other super mutants? Yeah, get out the water. <laughs> Okay, well, there's a bridge. Maybe there's a way I can get up there from here. That'd be nice. Well, I found a caravan. <laughs> oh, super mutants. Okay, that grenade was... Look, I'm gonna try it. Can you stop throwing grenades? I think that bike is gonna blow up. <laughs> well, they all went into hiding. Ah. Uh. <laughs> I heard of the super mutants. There's more where that came from. I'm glad he's not talking to hey. me. Hey. Yeah. Well, the Pip Boy is very uh, descriptive in naming places. That's for damn sure. Irradiated Metro. I shall stay out then. I don't see anything up there. And yeah, that that bike is uh, slowly exploding. There's nothing up there. And I think the Brahmin's stuck. Huh? Oh no, I see something. I just saw movement. No. Don't shoot at it. Mm, can I help it along? Well, I don't want to waste any more ammo. Is it done exploding? If I run past all of this... <laughs> well, I'm not gonna jump down from here. That That's... Mm -mm -mm -mm. Uh, 
And yes, it is in fact done exploding. And yes, there are super mutants up there. You're here. You're here. Stop hiding. Wee. Yep. <laughs> I don't see it. Oh, I see the movement, but I don't think I can climb up from here. That seems a little too steep. But maybe, just maybe, I can make this jump. Hello, you. There it is. This is not very good cover. Probably better off here. <laughs> oh, the caravan's coming. I heard them. But I don't see them. I see the movement sometimes, but it's not... Well, it is nighttime, so... Wait, hold on a moment. I need to get this Pip-Boy to not display. Because I... Um, I need to take a picture. Mm. Mm, too close to the ground. Like so. <laughs> There's your wallpaper for tonight, kids. <laughs> uh, and we can make the pip boy come back. Like so. Okay, ooh. Actually, since you survived, Lucky Harith, you took most of my money. A wanderer without a weapon doesn't last long out there. Pick up the best now, while you still can. While I still can. Okay, I'm here to buy. It's my pleasure to offer hot death in a variety of exciting flavors. You can have that. Take your pick. You can have that. I'm keeping the bar, thank you very much. Um... The FN, uh, you can have that. You can have the grenades. Uh, you can have the M1. Mm, it's very broken. If it was in slightly better condition, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. possibly you could have the Watts laser pistol because my god, that was terrible. I'm keeping the hunting rifle because I need something long range. I'm half tempted to just sell the Red Rider BB gun. But it's not weighing me down terribly, so I'm gonna keep it. Let's see. Uh, ammo I don't need. Five mil. Take it. Seven sixty-two. No, I need the uh, thirty oh six. Yes, I don't have anything for nine mil right now. You can have the dart. You can have the energy cells. That's all right. You can have the missiles. That's okay. Uh, I'm gonna keep the rest. What ammo you got? Um, you're a bit lacking. You're very lack, but you do have some seven six. Wait, you're willing to pay me six hundred and sixty six caps? Huh. Well, in that case, <laughs> uh, gimme. <laughs> Yeah, no, that was too good not to take. Um, let's see. You still have some money on you, don't you? You can have the Alprazolam. There we go. Uh, I could have the carton of cigarettes. Uh, ibuprofen I'm keeping. I'm keeping the aspirin as well. You can have the blood bags. I don't know what kind of diseases that stuff's carrying. Just, yeah. Blind congressional style. I'll probably try and read it when I stop to catch a break. Which, you know, <laughs> I think this is the first night that I've spent out in the wasteland now that I'm... I, that I've stopped and actually had a moment to think about it. That That is the first time that I'm spending the night out in the wasteland. 
and I'm slightly more intelligent because of that bobblehead somehow. That's <laughs> that's how the world works. I <laughs> you want a thousand? Sorry, thirteen hundred and eleven caps for schematics. Uh there's a word for that. I believe it's no. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Another satisfied customer. You need to find more ten mil ammo or some five fifty six ammo. Sharp and your eyes peeled. Some shotgun oh. shells. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Hello. Let's say. Where am I going? Well, I'm going west, and I was right. That was a bridge. So that's that's Great Edge. I'm basically headed right back into Great Edge. Everything leads back to Great Edge. God damn you, Brian Wilkes. Well. One thing's for sure, uh, apparently that holotape that uh, Grady left me had the um, coordinates to Girder Shade embedded in it, so that is the westmost point on the map that I have. So we're going to Girder Shade. To Girder Shade then. Wouldn't it be nice <laughs> if this bridge just went on forever? <laughs> it would just take me directly into Girder Shade, like the uh, <laughs> the road map here seems to suggest. Well, now actually, uh, it stops. It turns left at Marigold. Uh, hmm. Turns left. Well, I could turn left. That would put me at the big building with the uh, crane. What the hell? Oh, someone's shooting at me. Maybe. No. I hit it! Whatever it was, I hit it! <laughs> it's running away now. It hid behind a rock. That's a lot of red blips. And I hear... I hear people! I probably shouldn't have shot at it. <laughs> Got her! <laughs> Okay, so they're behind there. Uh, sneaky peeky. Where are they? There's one. Okay. Where's the rest of them? I saw like three in there, so. And I heard two of them talking, so there's at least two. Oh, hello. Someone was doing a very good job of concealing themselves, weren't you? <laughs> oh, thanks for the assist there, Harith. Want some more? Ooh, that's an automatic. Glad Hello. that's over. <laughs> <laughs> Better him than me. Hey. All right. Wow, it's so dark in here, I can't even see the floor. Okay. Um, uh, these people had guns, so I'm gonna loot their guns. 45, and some ammo for the 45, as well as a Scorpio machine pistol. How about you? 
Chinese officer sword. Might be worth something if I sell it, maybe. <laughs> Although this carton of cigarettes is probably worth more because I'm not running sword in hand. <laughs> right, there's the other one. I shot one out here. There she is. Just a pack of cigarettes, no. Uh, that's a teeny tiny little footlocker. Oh, booze. Right on. Nuka Cola. A cup. Ooh. And some food. Not that I need it. I have plenty of food, but. Actually. <laughs> he too went there, so if I follow his caravan, I might have some help. As I, uh, as I go, ah, here's the safe. Can I open the safe? No. No, I cannot open the safe. I should probably learn how to lockpick something that's not, you know, easy. Um, I could always sell that. I could sell that. Uh, it's a bottle cap. There's a bottle cap. And there's a bottle cap. Okay, I'll have to run to catch up to Lucky Harith, but I'll take it. Okay, so, yeah. My choice here is going up, and then catching this road here, and then going all the way back down to Girder Shade. Or I can go down and around here then go all the way up to girder shade all right hmm. i am curious about that building let's go see what the building is <laughs> and yeah following the caravan may very well increase my chances of survival what are you doing all the way out there already Eesh. i was just looking at the map the citadel Hmm. Wow. Aren't you boys well equipped? What's, uh, what's going on here? Hello. Name's Paladin Bale. What do you need, civilian? Uh, what's this place? You're standing in front of the Citadel. Headquarters to the Brotherhood of Steel. Capital Wasteland Detachment. Okay, um, what, 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 what is a Brotherhood of Steel outside of that really cool looking armor and logo that you got on your, uh, pauldrons there? I can see you're trying to appeal to my good nature. Pity for you, I don't have one. I'll give you this one for free. Okay. We use our big guns to kill big super mutants, so people like you can sleep at night. You know, if it weren't for the fact that you were holding a minigun and wearing power armor, the conversation would be a bit different right now. So, can I come in? Negative. No super mutants, civilians, or traveling salesmen allowed. Oh, that's why the caravan Which didn't stop. You? Okay. Well, I would very much like to uh, learn how to use power armor, but I assume no one in there will teach me, given your uh, demeanor. Of course. But you'd have to secure the permission of Elder Lions and, well, I just don't see that happening. So move along. Uh-huh. Right. Well, <laughs> admittedly, that, of course, kind of threw me off a little bit. <laughs> okay. Well, I, uh, I'm going a, I'm to a go. I, I got a caravan to catch up with. Steel be with you. Yeah. Whatever that means. Uh, lucky. Wait. You just stop there. Oh, I guess you were watering the Brahmin, so to speak. Uh, huh? No crippled limbs. Good. That was our own key. <laughs> well, I'm going to follow the caravan. And I will keep 
heading good to see well, you. right now I'm heading south, Leaving. but I need to get around the uh, the building. So, uh, I'll keep heading south then. Looking to make a trade? Uh, no, the Brotherhood people don't want to make a trades. Although that's, you know, comparatively speaking, Hello. that's some really nice power armor. That's really nice power armor, actually. Well, yours is pretty cool too, but clearly not, you know, that good. Okay. So we've met the Brotherhood of Steel. And their fancy, fancy power armor. Um. Alright. Okay. People's Republic of America. Radio signal found. Okay. What does that sound like? All these loving people must join together to stop the war There's of a lot of static. being waged by the Wall Street gang. Why do you continue to send your boys to die for your capitalist hey. masters? Do you think your readers will keep you safe if the bombs fall? You will die while the Wall Street gang and their hangers-on live like kings and... Okay, that's, um... Certainly a thing. Wherever that's coming from. Clearly, not, I'm not anywhere near it, because that, that sounded way too staticky. But, yeah, no, um, um... I'm gonna keep following the caravan until I can finally go west. And I'll Hello. try to pick my way to Girdershade. Maybe should be easy to find Hello. something there. Good to see you. Oh god, the laws of physics are breaking again. I wanna follow you guys, but uh You're not helping me right now. <laughs> I'm gonna go over there and boop you. Hey there. There. Evening. Also, I'm not entirely sure that's the way you hold a uh, minigun. But hey, I mean, you do you. You're the one carrying it. If you're not getting tired, I. That. Yeah. Good to see you. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it may very well be the case that that is the single most effective way to shoot a minigun. But, uh... Maybe he's got, like, really strong arms. Like, really, really strong. <laughs> What's that? That's a centaur. Excuse you. I hope you know what you're doing. Yes, I do. Mm. I'm tagging along. I'm make myself useful, and I can't really hey. do much other than shoot things, and not very well. So, yeah. Say, uh, lucky. Why did I call you that? Fine, ignore my question, I don't care. And with this, our hero continues his journey. This time, he's headed west. To Girdershade. Where is Girdershade? What is Girdershade? We don't know. But we will find out. Next time. Probably not going to be next week. Because next week I actually want to stream a different game. But... Yeah, the week after, Fallout will return. So, stay tuned. Uh, we've had the first six um, episodes with a uh, more technical setup -y one at first. And yeah, we're gonna go from here. So, thank you all 
very much for joining. Good night to you as well, Arthur. And thank you for uh, being usually the first one in and the last one out. <laughs> you can cheese that to locate hard to find enemies. Yes. I, that, that will very most likely come in handy since um, I'm making my way to Girder Shade in the dark. <laughs> All right. Thank you all, seriously. Thank you all very much for joining me. Tomorrow, it's uh, Linux Weekly Daily Wednesdays. It will be a bit earlier than this, uh, like a couple hours earlier than this, actually, at uh, 8 p.m. GMT or 3 p.m. Uh, EDT. Tune in then. We will... Uh, well, we'll talk about some Linuxy news. And, of course, on... Um, on Thursday, Ven and Jordan are still go, uh, going through uh, Wolfenstein Youngblood. I'm never sure. Um, on, let's see, on Friday, Ven will be streaming something. And of course, on Saturday, it's uh, Linux Gamecast Weekly, the titular show of this Hello. very channel. So yeah, if you liked it, give us a follow. If you didn't like it, I, I don't know, there's plenty other channels <laughs> so thank you all and i shall see you again next time bye good to see you